What is up? It's your boy Queen here coming with y'all with another reaction video, and we are about to hop into volume seven. And it's crazy for me to sit here and think about this because you know we've I've been doing this for months at this point, you know, catching up with the show, and to think that we only got two volumes left. We got this one, and then the most recent one I believe is volume eight, which I think ended recently, if I'm not mistaken, or somewhat recently. So yeah, we got two volumes left, and I'm gonna be caught up with all y'all. That's actually crazy to think about. But anyway, we finna hop into the reaction. Let's get it. So where are we starting at? It's still crazy to finally find out what happened to the moon. That's still wild to me. Fucking goddess of darkness just said, fuck this moon on his way out. God damn. approach to Atlas Docking Bay Omega 12. A security team will meet you there. Over. I don't understand. What's happening here? I don't know. <laughs> Something definitely happening. We, here. we got the lamp to Atlas, so I guess we land and get some answers. I'm not so sure. No, why is that? I've never seen our forces deployed so aggressively before. If we land in a stolen ship, there's no way the security team will let us anywhere near Iron. They might even take me back to my father. Yeah, definitely don't want that. So, Winter. Huh? We've got some distance between us and the fleet. You don't have to tell me twice. I'm calling up Winter. Man, we haven't seen Winter since Volume Three. Oh, these are the streets below the city. I'm getting some uh, some Gotham vibes. Oh, Ironwood got a beard now. got drones just patrolling the streets and I'm guessing people really don't like them this isn't right none of this is right Manta 5 one we've noticed a detour in your route you are to make your way to docking bay omega 12 immediately do you copy over we're kind of running out of time here kids we need to ditch the ship agreed get lost in mantle and buy ourselves some time I'm telling mm. you my sister can take us to ironwood uh Twice? Uh oh. What are we about to see? A reminder. Hmm? Failure to cooperate with Atlas military personnel is a punishable offense. Ah, uh, fuck. Winter? No offense, Weiss. I'm not sure that's a good idea anymore. There's obviously something very wrong. If we can just talk to her, then we. Look, I'm not even sure we should be talking to Ironwood. Until we know exactly what's going on with Mantle. But everyone, calm down. <sighs> I know someone who can help with both. Oh, for real. It's such a goofy Jeez, ass. Uh, take a hint. Mm. Yeah, that, I don't know why. I'm really getting some strong Gotham vibes from this city right now. Yeah, she's not even using the cane no more. She's just walking. Many soldiers normal? No. Nope. At least I didn't think so. Huh? Bruh. So they really just got cameras on drones going around. Bruh. 
Ah. No. This randomly taking pictures of. Sh oh shit. Maybe we should pick up the pace. So it is. The yeah, drones just go around randomly taking pictures of people. Of the Great War. The people of Mantle needed a sign of a brighter future, and that sign was Atlas. After all, a home in the clouds is about as bright as it gets. Nah, shit. Unless you're the one having to look up at it. This whole city, it just seems awful. Yeah? You don't like it here? There's plenty of space out in the tundra. Sorry, I didn't mean to. Alice is the greatest kingdom in the world, all right? Hey! Mm. We can't cause a scene. The embargo... The embargo's got us in a rough patch. But it'll blow over. <laughs> You'll see. We try and help the other kingdoms, and this is what happens? I say let them rot! Mm. I apologize. I didn't mean to insult you. Stupid finest like you. Ah, uh, fuck. Damn, Weiss. <laughs> it was worth it. Hey, wait! You're, that, that was wild! Bruh. We are here for your safety. Mm -mm -mm. Thank you for your cooperation. Yeah, so far, this city do seem awful. It's probably always like kind of dark there too because you know floating city and all that shit is right above them. So this is an old friend. Ah yes, yes. <laughs> Have we met? Well, this is off to a fantastic start. Have we met? Off to the limb plants. You adjust them every ten years or so. Maria, yes. Bro, it took that long. What the fuck? Oh, wow. Has it been that long already? This man wheelchair got legs. I I aged what like a the fine hell? Line. Would have been here sooner if I hadn't run into these jokers. At the time, I thought they might need my guidance while fighting a little old sphinx. Oh, did they? No, no. They had much more complicated issues. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and this is <sighs> so impatient. I didn't think I'd need to introduce one of Atlas's finest minds. Working Ooh. in a place like this? Bruh. He likes to keep a low profile. Something I've come to realize none of you know anything about. You can call me Pietro. Finest heart, Pietro. Too. This pharmacy is just where he volunteers when he's not building the future of Atlas alongside Ironwood up in the clouds. Oh, hmm. it's stuffy up there. Down here, I get to help the locals and have a little fun. So, who all lives up top, I wonder? You want to try them on? Yes! <laughs> Before we get to that, we were wondering if you could help us. We came to Atlas hoping to talk with General Ironwood, but... Um, what exactly has been happening here? <coughs> ah, shit, don't tell me you sick, too. Took a toll on all of us. James was no different. I couldn't tell you exactly what it was he saw there. But it changed him. He's... He's scared. Paranoid would be the more appropriate term. Mm. You have to understand, it wasn't just the grim. Someone completely dismantled Atlas security code, made it their plaything, and made us look like traitors to some and buffoons to everyone else. Mm, Who that is true. managed to do that is either a genius or one of our own. I fear the answer may be both, and so does the general. Mm. And so ever since that, he's just been paranoid. Atlas isn't as safe as we thought. Damn. After we came all this way, we can't just leave, can we? How does the council feel about all of this? Or Winter Sheen? Do you know anything about her? Well, the council's so scared they'll agree to whatever he wants. Though some representatives from Mantle are... Wait, you're... You're, you're why Sneed? Nah, I should. Wait, what was it that you were trying to say about Mantle? You painted it. What? 
Is everything okay? You're Team Ruby. Oh. They know that. Oh, my girl, I do. I most certainly do. And I feel like such a dunce for not recognizing you sooner. My daughter's told me so much about you. Your yeah. daughter? Daughter? Uh oh. Ah, shit. What's going on? Trouble. Wait. So we definitely know his daughter, but we don't know who it is right now. Let's see what's going down. Ah, oh, shit. Shit's still broke. Defenses aren't doing much. Somehow that doesn't surprise me. Hmm. Also, just random grim attacking. God damn. Oh, is these through the uh, the shits that Salem was creating? Oh no. It didn't come this far to feel now. No, it's not that. <laughs> Oh god damn, there's a lot of them. Ah oh, shit. Mm. Oh, she just wanted a boost. Oh. Okay. See what Oscar gonna do. Okay. Oh damn, he really one shot that thing. I swear this show When they really start trying, like this show looks so damn good with the action scenes, I swear. Had the Green Lantern or some shit. Wait, Penny? Man, I fucking knew it. See, I knew Penny was gonna be fine. Doc, why don't you say hello to your friend? Oh, so he created Penny. I figured she was gonna be fine since she was a robot. Aw, oh, shit. Here we go. I forgot she used to do this. God damn. <laughs> Salutations. But yeah, I knew she was gonna be fine. It's just, it's been so long though. Died? I guess in a manner of speaking, she did. But we were able to recover her core from Amity Arena once it had made its way back to Atlas. Yeah, see, I figured she was going to be fine. I'm as good as new, better even, and now I'm the official protector of the city. That's my Really? Name. We're not going to let a little ripping to shreds stop us, are we? <laughs> hmm? No, sir. This is... Strangely wholesome. Seems mm. like Penny to me. We have so many things to catch up about. I can't. Wait, is that an off button on her? <laughs> it seems we will have to wait. Bruh. <laughs> it seems we will have to wait. Hey, so Penny's back. I completely understand what's going on or have like a million questions. And thankfully, I have about a thousand answers. But let's get out of this weather first. I have absolutely no idea who that child was. Huh. Is she important somehow? That was unexpected. Never a dull moment. But I wouldn't say unwelcome. I was honestly expecting things to go a lot rougher. Oh, what now? Bullshit. God damn it, Crow. You just had to say something. 
Fuck. Who the fuck are these people? Good work, team. Hey, what's going on? Hey, pal. I'm a licensed huntsman. Just help save everyone. Oh, they taking their weapons. Man. They taking all the weapons. God damn it. Oh, please don't take that. Motherfucker. Hmm. Let's get them loaded into the next transport. Please. We were just trying to help. What is the meaning of this? <laughs> what are the Aesops even doing down here in Map? Aesops? Doctor, good to see you. Well, we heard a report of an unauthorized ship making an unauthorized landing, followed by an unauthorized use of weapons by non-licensed huntsmen. Yeah. If we can okay. talk this out, I guess that is pretty sure. Talk this out once they get up to Atlas. Let's move out. Wait, y'all not gonna take them up to Atlas? Y'all just gonna leave them on the ground? Okay, there we go. Now this, <laughs> this is much closer to what I was expecting. Mm -hmm. God damn, that's the end. Man. That's a different type of out. Wait, we have an outro? Oh, it's right, intro. I'm only, I must about to skip the intro. Ah, shit. Volume 7. Ooh, new cut? Oh, yo, everyone getting new fits? Oh, and this man. Oh, I'm guessing they're going to be very important. The A squad. Tyrion. Ah, uh, these two coming back. Yeah, so yeah, everyone gonna be rocking a new look by the looks of it. This little Penny's back. Mm -mm -mm. Whoa, John, bruh. Oh, a new character. Oh, Oscar will fight Ironwood. Damn, really, everyone got a new fit. That's crazy. Mm -mm -mm. Wait, hold on. We got to pause right there. Hold up. So, John got a new look. Blake got a new look. Ruby got a new look. Like, Yang just, you know, changed some clothes. But Weiss, god damn. Where all that hair come from? I don't remember her hair being like that, like that long. God damn. Let's see. It looked like uh, Crow got some new drip too. God damn. Be a solid opening episode into the new season. We got Penny back. Cause I see some of y'all was like, oh man, you know she gone. She ain't coming back. And I was like, man, if she mechanical, she could be fixed. And now she back. It took a long fucking time though, but hey, she finally back on the show. And it looks like everyone's gonna get a new look. And it looks like uh, that A squad's probably gonna be pretty damn important since they were in the intro too. So they're gonna play a factor. And it looked like, uh, what's his name? I for always forget the name of uh, Salem's henchman that has the long mask, the mustache. But it looked like uh, he was watching them. So let me find out this man got some type of like manipulation going with the ace squad or something. But I feel like those two are definitely connected somehow. Yeah, I cannot wait to hop into the rest of this volume. If y'all enjoyed the reaction, please feel free to leave a like and a subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.